this is a unboxing video this is my 25th chanel bag review and some other stuff that i got over the past couple of like two three weeks so i'm going to show you guys like all the stuff that i got especially since my instagram got deleted so i wasn't able to like post the stuff as i was getting it so i'm just going to do like a quick unboxing for you guys on here and it's also going to be posted on my tiktok and it's going to be posted on my ig as well so this chanel bag is a bag that i never had before from chanel and it's also a color that i never had before um i think i put up a question like a poll thing and i think like four people um guessed the right color bag but not the right type of bag so we're going to get into some things with that so first we're going to start out with the new chanel -y. are you ready no, just leave her down here. Anyway, guys, so I'm going to show you guys the 25th bag. Are you guys ready? Drum roll. Go upstairs. What? <laughs> Go upstairs. It was bad. Um, so guys, the the 25th bag was already open because I already took videos and stuff because I was going to um actually, hold on. It's my dad calling me. Hello. Hey, Dad. What's going on? You busy? I'm recording a YouTube video. Oh, man. Uh, yeah. It is, huh? Mm hmm. All right. All right. I just wanted to update you about some stuff, so hit me up uh, about the trip down there. Uh, Leanne's supposed to be going down there at the same time, so. Oh, she is? Down the area. Yeah. Oh, all right, so you only got to book you a flight? Huh? So what you only got to book you a flight? Well, isn't she? Book huh? me a flight on the way down. Ari going to go back with her mom. Because, of course, I got to be back. So guys, um, this bag is so beautiful, like so beautiful, and it's something that I actually been wanting for a long time, but I wanted like a neutral color, but this color just stuck out like a sore thumb. You didn't have it for a long time. I just got it. Yeah, so you didn't have it for a long time. I said I wanted it for a long time. Stay out my conversation. That's your problem. <laughs> <laughs> that was my conversation. Bye. See you later. Love you. So, guys, um, I've been wearing this bag for a really, really long time. Also, not this color, but, like, this style bag because I don't have one. And, you know, I need what I need. So, and also, I already opened this bag because I had it for, like, three weeks or so now. So, I've been opened it, been to the video. Then I lost my Instagram. Then I couldn't post. And then I was still, like, getting stuff over the, like, I think my Instagram was down for like 11 days, so I still was like receiving gifts and stuff then. So that's why I'm just doing like a whole unboxing video because this video was only supposed to be a reveal video. But I'm giving y'all something a little juicy, like a little juicy, like reveal and unboxings, okay? You guys see? Hey guys. Yeah. 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 Oh, look at this bag. Isn't it beautiful? And I already like adjusted the straps. So this is the shortest that it. So, like y'all, and I don't have a blue bag. I have like navy blue. But I don't have this color. This is like a powder blue, like a baby blue. I really love this. This is a good buy. I love it so much. Like, I don't know if y'all can get into the details. Look at the... So what is that? What? That. A backpack. Small. <laughs> uh, it's so hard trying to record it with a seven-year-old. He's a terrorist, a menace to society. Like, why do you keep... I cut out so much, y'all don't understand. Anyway. She's really small, but super cute with the summertime. Like, watch when I wear it with denim and... What did I order to go with this? Oh, like a poochie, like a, that blue poochie. Oh, fire with this. Ooh. She's actually really not that small when you think about it. So I want to keep all this tissue paper because I want it to stay like in its shape. Because one thing about Chanel bags, it will lose its shape. So this is the inside. 
They had a pink one too in there, but I really, really like this one. And also, since this was my 25th bag, I wanted it, well, 25th Chanel bag. I wanted it to be something that I never had before, like an exclusive bag because it's like a milestone bag. But I also got two more of them that I got over the past couple of like weeks. I want to show you guys that too. But this is like the start of the show. Yeah, this is the, large. ain't it? Yeah. But yeah, this is super cute. Like y'all, and I don't have a blue bag. I have like navy blue. I don't have this color. This is like a powder blue, like a baby blue. I really love it. This is a good buy. I love it so much. Uh, what is that? What? That. A backpack. Small. <laughs> uh, it's so hard trying to record it with a seven-year-old. He's a terrorist, a menace to society. Like... Why do you keep, I cut out so much, y'all don't understand. Anyway, yeah, she's so beautiful. I love her. She's actually very small, but super cute for the summertime. Like, watch when I wear it with denim, like with a denim outfit, this would be too super cute. What did I order to go with this? Oh, like a poochie, like a, that blue poochie. Oh, fire with this. So anyway. Ooh. She's actually really not that small, when you think about it. So I want to keep all this tissue paper because I want it to stay like in its shape. Because one thing about Chanel bags, it will lose its shape. So this is the inside. It's pretty spacious. I feel like it could fit a good amount of stuff in there. It definitely can't fit an iPad, a laptop, or none of that. But it can fit like your phone, your wallet and all that good stuff. Where's my card holder? It's upstairs. Yeah, she's done. Yeah, she's done. Let me go to the next one. And I already opened them up because I just did a TikTok. So if you want to see me like actually unboxing the stuff, go on my TikTok and watch. But this is a light purple. Um, this is a boy bag. It's light purple. Um, get into the color. This bag it was $6,600. Super cute. Love her. So then I also got her... Why is there only one more? You make him a sandwich. You don't want none of that Domino's cheesy bread and stuff. I'll take it. Okay, so put that bread in. Get a plate. Get a plate. So yeah, this is the third item that I received. It's so cute. It's like a purple and blue. Kind of not even blue, like maybe a light purple and dark purple mixed. It's so beautiful. I don't know if y'all can get into the color. Let me turn the light a little bit. Can I get into that color? I love this. And this bag was um, $5,400 before tax. Super cute. Um, yeah, so I got that. Um, all of this stuff is gifts besides like two or three of the items I bought. I'm gonna let y'all know what I bought because apparently people be all in my business right about what I'm buying. Like I been wasn't Little Miss put up. Did y'all forget? I got these Givenchy boots. This is, my this is my first purchase. Um, Probably the last time I bought myself something. I really don't even remember. Probably been like a year and a half now since. But um, I got these boots. They were $16.60. They're Givenchy boots. I never really liked the sneaker version, but... These are tea. Like, I love these. But I got this bag to go with it. She was also, like, $1,600. And it's, like, a matching set, kind of. Um, I don't know. It 
just went. So I got them. Um, this is a Givenchy. I think it's called an antique. I can't remember what it's called, but I had one of these a long time ago. I had a blue one, but I sold it. But um, super cute. And it's white. And I don't have, I do have a lot of white bags, but I don't have like a small, like I need more basically. So this is definitely going to come in handy. Yeah, so I already know that this video is going to cause a lot of conversation. Hopefully it's just all positive. Just be nice. Why don't you be nice to me? Um, who don't want to be nice to me? Like, look how, why would you not want to be nice to me? Honestly. Like, like, honestly, like, just knowing what I've been through and seeing how I'm strong and still moving on and still going through life with the punches, I'm just doing it fun in a fun way, doing it in a positive way, doing it in a way that I've been doing. It might be a little bit more umph because you know, you, you already, I don't have to put my business out there, but just know that I've been Little Miss Put Up. So why y'all acting like y'all forgot that I was Little Miss Put Up? And also, when have I ever not spoke on me buying something. I would love to tell you. If I did go and buy me all these Chanel bags back to back, I would love to tell you guys that. But that's just not the case, honey. It's just not the case. So, anyway, um, we just want to get the stuff that I did buy out the way now. Because, what would be wrong with y'all? So, I bought these. I think they were like $800 or something. But I've been wanting these slides for a while. And they're a little wet because I had them on when I just got out the shower. So, super cute. And they have like a glitter to it. I love these. They are so cute. Let's do it today. Yes. So, she, me, her, both the Givenchy and both the Balenciaga slides, okay? All right, now let's go back into the gifts, okay? Anyway. Like, people are just crazy. And the funniest part about y'all is that if my mom's alive, y'all know she would argue with y'all for seven days and seven nights. She would curse y'all out for 30 day straight she don't give a fuck but i just don't have time like i'm just gonna kill y'all when it hurts y'all wanna keep talking let's talk about it so anyway i also received these they're so cute um everybody knows that my mom loved fendi so when i get fendi gifts i just be feeling like people really um care or understand because i really love fendi because my mom loved fendi but these are some fuchsia slides or more javinci just the best that i'm eating what Mm, cheesy bread? Mm -mm. Pizza? Mm -mm. What? Mm -hmm. So, um, I got these Givenchy pool slides. I got these because for someone's birthday that's coming up. Can't talk about it. But for my birthday that's coming up, we wearing Givenchy girl with a match. So, I got these pool slides for the pool party. And they're so cute. I probably won't wear them that much, but... If it was a look involved, let's do it. Let's do it. Let's do it. This bag. So then we can go into some more Chanel stuff. Um, these just were released. I think these were like sixteen or thirteen hundred. They're nude. I really want y'all to get into the colors. So I'm gonna just turn the camera a little bit. But they're like tan and they're so mm -hmm. cute. I love these. Super cute. And then. I got some more Chanel sandals. Cannot go wrong with a Chanel sandal. Can throw this on the summertime dresses. I probably really would wear this for like a dress or shorts or something like that. But definitely super cute. And they had a white pair with pink, but I just didn't feel like I could really match them too much. With what I had. So um, they're sandals. I like and them. Thank you. I love you. Bye bye. So um, yeah, these are these. Um, I don't understand how happy I am to be getting this video out the way because when I tell y'all, all of this stuff has been stacked up in my closet. Like I finally can put everything away. So I'm really happy about that because imagine all of this stuff just sitting inside of your closet like it's irritating i don't know if y'all can see but it's just so much stuff and then it all was in its own shopping bag so it's just so much stuff so i got these um Bottega sneakers as well i wound up returning the other ones because they were 37 so i had to get a 38 in them 
these fit way better so if you um want to get these sneakers make sure you go up a size because i usually never have to go up a size when people say go up a size but in these i had to go up a size because it's something with like the top of the sneaker it was just touching the top of my foot and i didn't like it like not the like the top like where my toenails are it was just rubbing and i didn't like that at all so got these i love these um, I was told that it was supposed to be a pair of earrings too, because this this is a scarf. It goes to the classic, the mini classic that I got. I'm gonna show you guys that again. Yeah, let's see what it's given. But this is the scarf. And I really don't know where the earrings went. I think that the lady probably didn't put it in the bag because I don't see no earrings. So I just told them to call the sales rep again to figure out if she packed it or didn't pack it or maybe something, whatever. But yeah, this is the scarf. This is the other side of the scarf. And this is the other side. And that's all you matched it. That's so <laughs> <laughs> Bless you. Like, who is she? Who is she? Who is she? So now I'm on Chanel bag number 27. So, yeah. <laughs> I love I love purses in general, but I just start like really wanting to collect like all the Chanel bags because I notice just from shopping a lot, Chanel bags hold its value. Like any bag that I have, even if I have a bag from three years ago, I still can sell it for the same price or even more. So I feel like that's a good investment than to buy, be buying like trendy stuff that just came out and then it's going to be out of style in a year or maybe six months. And now I'm just sitting here like the Balenciaga boots that I wore on New Year's with the piercings in it. I feel like I should have got the plain ones because I feel like the ones with the um, piercings in it is a little trendy like I feel like I really can't wear them too much again like I probably can wear them one more time and then also if I wanted to resell them on my Depop or on any type of website I would have to sell them for like a thousand dollars or maybe even cheaper when I spent well I didn't spend but when, when 3200 was spent on them so I felt like that was just a dumb purchase and I should have just got the plain ones instead but you live and you learn you know so yeah that's why I like um chanel stuff because i just feel like it lasts longer i feel like you can resell it anytime for the same damn price probably a little bit cheaper like it's just and they're just pretty bags they have so many different colors they they're bags that really go with everything i just love them like i love i love all of my things like i honestly do what else did i want to speak on oh see me the people that i follow like i follow people that i'm inspired by i follow people that like i want to be like or like i i oh your life oh yeah your life is lit like i i f with your life that's the kind of people i follow i don't follow people that like when i look at their life i get irritated by them doing the stuff that they're doing because it inspires me it's stuff that i like so why do y'all follow people that does things that y'all don't like like if shopping is like a deal breaker for you when you follow somebody hit unfollow because i'm never going to stop shopping i'm going to always shop and i'm going to always do what i like to do because that's what i've always done like you can click on my highlights on my page and you can go back three years ago i've been doing the shopping thing so i'm 26 years old 27 by the end of the year i'll be 27 and soon i'll be 30 and it's going to be even worse now i mean worse then than it is now so it's like either you're going to watch and you're going to cheer me on or you're going to watch and you're going to hate but no matter what you say, I want to always do what I want to do and how I want to do it. Please stop watching from your own views because your views on what's expensive or what's too much is not other people's views that's expensive or too much. Because I follow so many girls that be getting way more sh than what I get. So it makes what I get look like nothing. So I just be like so confused on like, y'all want me to just stop here? I'm trying to go for the moon, the stars. I want everything in this world. That's just what it is. Life is too short. Like, tomorrow's not promised anyway. So why not just live your life, have fun, and do what you like to do? And I like to shop. I like to go on vacation. I like to get dressed. I like to make money. That's what I like to do. And you do what you like to do. And you also follow people that you like. So you don't have to put out negative comments about people, okay? But anyway, back to my actual supporters. I love you guys. Thanks for watching. Comment down below your favorite item that I received. Make sure you go on my TikTok and watch my unboxing video. Um, it'll be out by the time this is out. Um, I'm going to try to post it like back to back so that 
one or the other can go back and forth and watch the videos because I told my TikTok to go on my YouTube and I'm telling my YouTube to go on my TikTok. So yeah, I love you guys. Make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. Record your favorite clips. Put it on your story. Put it on your TV. Watch it. Tag me. I want to be reposting everybody's videos. Okay? Love you guys.